Students across Ontario walked out of their classrooms and marched for their voices to be heard. Over 100,000 students from 700 schools were expected to participate in the walkout Thursday afternoon. Here at A.B. Lucas High School, hundreds of students will be walking out in protest to the Ford government's changes in education. If we can get everyone rallied up, we can actually make a change as opposed to just standing by and doing nothing. I'd rather try to do something and it failing than just knowing that we didn't try anything at all. Local NDP MPP Terrence Kernahan joined students in solidarity, making sure to show his support. This really shows how engaged and how interested students are. They're passionate and they were standing up for their education. Many students are concerned about the quality of their education in and out of the classroom. A lot of students already struggle learning inside the classroom, let alone actually learning on their own and fully teaching themselves the full course. So making four courses mandatory each year, I think is going to have a major impact on our students future. Some grade 12 students are even beginning to worry about the OSAP changes. Not having enough money saved for um, secondary education, it's really needed to get that um, to be able to attend um, university or college next year so it's, it's really hard to have that happen and it's a really sudden change that's just affecting us last minute. The Ford government plans to ban cell phones, increasing the number of students in classrooms and four mandatory e-learning courses. Students across the province use the hashtag students say no in hopes to not see these changes come to fruition. Emma Fairgrieve, CTV News.